Recording is on. There we go. Okay. Okay. Are we okay if Brian comes through first? Is that cool? Because that was another name that kept coming up. They kept, but it wasn't him saying it. They were saying it. But that was just in my, in in me when I meditate. Kept saying Brian, Brian, and I was like, I was like, okay, so are we gonna let Brian in? And they're like, do you give me permission? And I was like, yeah, I give you permission. That's why I'm here to do this. So hang on. Okay, let me get in with Brian now that we have allowed him. Hold on. Hold on. Oh, hold on. Why would he call you his best friend? Oh. Um, he was really close. Really? Was really okay. Close. Oh, okay, cool. No, it's okay. He said that was my best friend, Amy. I said, oh, okay. Like that, like that type of companionship. Hang on. Now he's going to be a word person. Hang on. Mm. Okay, so was his death a shock because he said they couldn't believe I was gone? Yeah? Okay. Yeah. Hang on. He's actually um, my brother in law. <gasps> really? That's why. Oh, okay. Okay. He has a very nice, pleasant voice. Hang on. Sorry, in my head, he's very nice. Hang on, hang on. Uh, he jokes, he jokes a lot. He jokes about you. Was he not married? Um, he was not at okay. the time. Okay, okay. No, it's, it's, it's a thing, because he's, he's like joshing about like you being married or something like that and being married to him or like whatever it is. It's just like this funny little bit her back and like just not not like trying to, but you know how people yeah hang on poke at it. Hang on. Hold on. It's not like when I got up I just decided to die. Hang on. I'm gonna ask him. We're just gonna get into it because I let me ask him. He pulled back. Let me bring him back forward. Hang on. Wait, so they found him dead? Um, I, Why he collapsed. Saying, okay, because this is what he just said. He said, he said, oh, well, when they found me, he said there was not much they could do for me anyways. He said that was, that was pretty much it. Because they always like to, okay, hang on. Huh. So on, on this thing that killed him, he said he said there was no signs or symptoms or anything before him. Um I I guess not. He I think he had a heart condition at some point, maybe. He's talking about like blood pressure issues in my head. Like he's making me feel like getting really um god full that's the way it feels to me like pressure and then like feeling really weak all at the same time so i don't know if that's that's just what feels like in my body hang on <laughs> oh wow <laughs> he um did he did he joke about dying before other people or joke about that or something like that uh, you know, not, not that i can you know. recall or anything okay because he's he's talking he feels like a very very normal everyday guy but then he he just has like when he talks i'm just kind of just trying to describe his voice when he talks he talks very quickly and a little bit quiet so it's like oh, 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 hang on <laughs> like hold on hold on Wait, he's from Texas? Uh, yes. Okay, cool. Okay. Yeah, we're in, I'm in the woods. Oh, you are? Really? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Okay. okay. Sorry, he showed me my <laughs> Texas tattoo. Like, he just showed me that. And I was like, oh, he's that good old Texas boy. I was like, oh, okay. Yeah. <laughs> yes. Hang on. Do you know if he's with his dad? Oh, we'll get into that. Don't worry about it. Hang on. 
I can bring them both forward. Hang on. Ooh, wait, is Richard his father? Who's Richard? Why is Richard saying I'm a father? It's my dad. Oh, it's your dad. Oh, okay. So they said, I'm a dad. I'm a dad. I was like, wait, so this is your dad? Okay, cool. Hang on. Oh, I love it. Hang on. Wait. Mm -hmm. Hold on. So he's talking about, okay, we're going to get into all of them. Uh, Richard's talking about picking up from where he started. That's a weird phrase. Hang on. Let me get into what does that mean? Hang on. Hang on. Hang on. Hold on. He's all about, why would Richard be all about, hold on, trying to make people proud? What is going on with that? Hang on. That's interesting for a man like that to say. That's why I'm like, oh, hang on. Wait, 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 wait. They were really worried about me. Wait. Now I'm trying to, whenever two come into play and we're entering it, it's like, okay, where do we file each component? So that's what I'm trying to do right now. Hang on. Hang on. He's like, what, what, what? Go, go ahead. Go ahead. Let him go. Let him go. <laughs> well, hold on. Let me get here first. And then we'll, we'll bounce back and forth between everybody. Hang on. I just need to stabilize everything first. <clears throat> hold on. Where's my kids? Kids? Hold on. Hold on. Now it's like they're showing. It's so interesting because they both live very. Who's the person that always wore? Because it's interesting because they have similar body types in a way. Who? Why? I think this is your father. Is your does your father? Okay, hold on. He's wearing a polo. I know what he's showing me, but I don't know how to describe it. Hold on. No, that's him. Why is he wearing? Somebody keeps showing me that they're wearing like a light blue polo that has a collar on it, and they have like khaki pants on and like a black belt, and they're trying to tell me what they do for their job, and I don't know what that is, and don't tell me yet, but like that's where they haven't been channeled before, so they're showing me this image, and I'm like, all right, come on, come on, come on, hang on, hang on. Who had a oh. Hold on. Did one of them, was one of them like the boss and like partly owned like a small company or something like that? Um, or like, yes. Or like managed a small fleet or yeah, like, yes. did? which one is that one? That's um, what they, my brother. Okay. My brother-in-law, Brian. Okay. Cause he's like showing me like what would be like old phone clip on like our pocket and stuff like that. And so that's why I'm like, what do you do? Hang on. Did he have work trucks or something like um, that? Um, he had like work vehicles for equipment. Okay. That they need. Okay. Okay. I'm like, where is all this going? Okay. Hang on. You know, that's the only thing I can think of. Yeah. Okay. Was it in like, not tele was it like telecommunications or what did he do what is he in um they used to own a dj company their own dj company and so speakers and then they used to set up like sound systems for parties and okay. things like that okay because he keeps showing me like headphones and he keeps yes. showing me like, microphones and i'm like are we in telecom? Like, what are we? I've never had DJ is a career. So the things that he's setting up for me in my head, I'm like, what does this mean? Hang on. Hold on. Wait. Oh. 
all little kids. He's oh, he went all around town. He went all the way down to Houston, everywhere. Yes. Ooh, yes. Oh my. Okay. Oh, okay. Oh, he did weddings mostly though. Hang on. Wait. Yes. So he yes. says. Or big thing. He's talking about not going south. So we really stayed in like the north central side. Anyways, that's a whole nother thing. Hang on. <laughs> he said, man, I had fun. I had fun. Wait, okay. So are you are you actually you are married, correct? I am. Okay, cool. Because he was but talking this... about did he do y'all's wedding? No. Okay. <laughs> no. Because he, he specifically said, he said, we had fun at their wedding. That's why I'm like, what goes on with that? Hang on. Um, maybe him and my sister's wedding. Okay. Okay. Hang on. Hang on. He's showing me like, dude, hang on real quick. Let me get into him some more. Hang on. <laughs> okay. So he's, <laughs> wow. So he did collapse. He goes, hold on. He says, well, was the exact words. He said, well, I really didn't get to, you know, tell anybody bye. He's like, I, I'm really, really sorry about that. Just, just very point blank. <laughs> I'm like, oh, okay. He's like, I really wasn't planning on it at that point. Hang on. Much. Oh my God. Your poor dad. Did your, he said your dad had it. He said that your father had it much worse than him. Is that correct? Uh, I'm, I'm not sure. Okay. Hang on. That's what he said. He's like, makes a comment on him and I haven't been there yet. So hang on, hang on. Hold on. Why does he keep saying like your dad was trying really, was your dad like remorphing his life or changing his life around or getting his life better? Or had he met a, made a lot of big changes to change his own life? Um, so he, I, I don't know if I can say that because he had just gotten out of um, prison. Okay, because pause real quick, because this is what Brian said. Brian said he was trying to change his life around. That's specifically what was said. That's why I'm like, that usually means that we're dying of an old and getting into a new or like moving back around. Hang on. <clears throat> it's like this big flip. Hang on. Hold on. So your father is taking an account for... I think they're in two very separate spaces because Brian feels like this is just, I'm just going to walk you through how it feels for me. Brian feels like, oops, here we are. Boom, boom. Dad feels like I semi fucked up or messed up a little bit. And now I'm here where I'm at. And they're both. So it, for me, it's like when you channel, it's almost like tuning into a radio, like you're in certain frequencies and certain channels. And so they talk about each other, but I have to be in both of their spaces because they're separate. So anyways, we'll get into that in a second. So we'll tune down to dad, which is not bad. It's good, but it's still, <laughs> hang on, hold on. That's why he said he had it worse than him. Ah, oh, hang on, hang on. Let me get into Brian real quick again. Hang on, well, not real quick. Right. He talks about, would y'all talk shit all the time? <laughs> yes. Okay. He said, man, she was the best thing that came into our lives. He was like, man, we talk shit all the time. All the yes. time. I said, oh, okay, good, good. He was like, give her hell like that. And I'm like, yes. you're not, oh, hold on. We'd mess with each other. He's talking about y'all being like just two like big kids in a way. Yes. Just like. I, I mean, down to like poking or like being very annoying with each other. That's what he's showing. He's like bugging you. Hang on. But yeah. do you ever feel like, this is not your dad. This is Brian. Do you ever feel like somebody's like standing behind you or next to you? And then you like, you turn around and nobody's there. Or like, you just feel like this odd like presence and then nobody's there. And it's like, anyways, if, if you ever feel that way, that's him. Cause he's more of a playful type of person. Um, Hang on. Hang on. Oh, man. Oh, so Brian didn't have any kids or anything. Hang on. Hold on. Wait, he had a son? A daughter. Okay. She, why didn't he say she was away or it was away? Away. Did it not live with, did she not live with him? Uh, she lives with my sister. Okay. 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 He's like, she's away. She's away. I was like, okay. Mm -hmm. Hang on. Mm -hmm.
very young mind. So it's a little, it's a little girl. Mm-hmm. Very, because they said, how old is she? Like, is she, you know, so how did she react to all this? And he's just like, oh, she's a very young mind, like being able to be, hold on. That was my sweetheart. That was my everything. That was my heaven. Oh my, hold on. She loved him so much. He's, he just said that was the only thing, that was the only person that mattered in my life. Yes. Yes. Very, hold on. Day I met her, I pledged to her to to change. Did he also like flip his life around too? Was he like not not nearly like dad, but he's talking about being more wild and then changing after he had her, or like being this one way and then yeah. actively, yeah. Because he's he's talking about you know I change my ways or I morph my ways or he's he's showing me literally like circles changing into other circles. That's my sign for that. Hang on. Yeah. I don't know what that means. Does somebody wear a necklace in memory of him or something? Because he says, now I'm just the thing that they wear around their neck or something like that. What is that? Um, I bought my niece a necklace that, um, and I gave it to her um, at this funeral. Um, and he was in the Navy, and so it has like Navy, and then it has an angel wing on it. So I hope she wears it. I don't know if she does. She needs to. That's exactly what he's pointing at. Because I'm like, what do they have of you? And he's like, you know, I have this. This is my signifier. So I'm like, oh, that's so old. And, oh, hold on. Hold on. Oh, hold on. Okay, this is a joke from Spirit. He said, I don't know if I was an angel, but I like your idea like that. And I'm like, can you stop? Like, you're terrible right now. Hang on. He does like this eyebrow thing to me where he like raises one up kind of or something like that. And I'm like, what are you doing? Hang on. I don't, I have too much Botox in my forehead, so I can't do it. Too much. But if I could, you'd be able to see it. So just imagine it happening. Okay. Hang on. Hang on. Oh. oh wow. Dress me up, got me ready for it. So is he buried? Um <clears throat> he's cremated. Yes. Why is he talking about did they change his clothes or something like that? Um we didn't have a um there's like no view yeah. um, I don't know um, talking about getting up dressed or getting them dressed up. It's not about at a funeral home. I don't know what that is. Hang on. Hold on. What? How? Sorry, this is my arguing with me, okay? Hold on. With with honor, so? Did they actually do a military funeral for him? Okay, cool, that's, <laughs> sorry. Yes. <laughs> that's the arguing, he goes, oh, with, he was talking about like, oh, I'm, I'm buried with honors. And I'm like, no, you can't do that, you're cremated. It's only when you bury, that's why I was arguing. I was like, no, you're not. And then he shows it to me again. And I was like, okay, fine, I'll say it, not a problem. Okay. Yeah. Oh, is he really? Oh, really? Um, in like the wall off of like Veterans Memorial at that cemetery, the Veterans he's Cemetery. Dad. Huh? He's with my dad. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's okay. I'm surprised my father hasn't shown up yet. Usually he shows up when there's military people involved. Honestly, hang on, hang on, hold on, wait. <laughs> He's such a jokester. Like he, he's calling me names in my head, like funny names. He's just like, "Oh, you sorry, blah blah blah." He's like, "I can't believe you didn't know that." And I'm like, "I'm like, you know, you need to shut up. Hang on, you're dead, not me. Hang on, hang on." <laughs> Wait. He's sorry, I just drilled. He's taking me through time of passing. He's 
standing up when he dies? I think he was walking and then he just. Yeah, because he's made, like, what I do with my elbow, he's making me feel the boom, boom, like the clunk. And I'm mm -hmm. like, my God, hang on. Yeah. Hang on. He said it wasn't very graceful, I tell you that. I'm like, obviously not, sir. Okay, hang on. Hang on. Wait, was he shorter? Was he like five eight, five seven? Um, oh, I can't remember. I don't maybe five eight, maybe. Okay, so he's kind of a shorter guy. Okay, because the he's not more than six feet, correct? I don't think so. Okay. Only reason ask about that and see just because they always compare themselves to me. So I'm six feet tall. That's how I get a gauge on like how big they are, whatever it is. And so he's shorter than me. And then he makes a joke. And I said, how did it feel? And he said, well, it wasn't too far to fall. And that's like a joke on that. And I'm like, okay. Thanks. Yeah. That's another thing too. Hang on. <laughs> Wait. I'm going to ask him where he was at. Hold on. Wait, was he outside when this happened? I don't believe so. Remember. But I didn't get a lot of information. I got gotcha. you. It's okay. Hold on. Hold on. Just because he feels like he fell out in concrete. That's why I'm like, hang on. Hold on. Hold on. So he looks, he's almost like, so wait, so this is your husband's brother, correct? Uh, my, my sister's ex-husband. Oh, okay, 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 okay. Okay. Did he know your husband? Yeah, yes. Okay, because he's giving him shit. That's the only reason I'm asking. He's like joking. <laughs> he's joking with him. He's he's almost, and that's why I'm like, I when he's talking to him, He's like joshing him. And I'm like, okay, are you older or younger? What does this work? And he's talking down to him almost like he's a kid or like younger than him or something like that. And he's like joking with him. But I know the other guy's older than him. But it's like he always feels like he's superior to everybody else in kind of a way. <laughs> Hold on. Hold on. Why would he tell your sister he's sorry? He says, he says, he says, if there's one thing I want to say, I want to tell her I'm sorry. And he's very sincere about it, though. So usually that means he was a little bit more cocky than normal. Um, and now, yeah, now he's um, much more sincere about it. Um, he, he couldn't really ever get back up on his feet um, for a long time. Um, but he tried. Um, he I mean, he tried. He did. And so I know exactly what that means. Yeah, he stays very like wholeheartedly telling her he's sorry. Like, and it's it's sometimes they let me into that loop of what it is about, and then other times it's something that I just have to tell you. So please convey the message to her, okay? Hold I on. will. Okay. So, why is he saying did he live a party lifestyle for a little bit okay Absolutely. Cause he, okay because i said what are you talking he said oh i live the party lifestyle and then he goes along with <laughs> like that oh, yeah. oh yes and like yeah. literally shows me this and, mm -hmm. and um he said oh i got really fucked up and i was yeah. like that's yeah he would stay up for like days sometimes oh. and go on like benders and my sister would be like well brian's on his bender so i gotta you know do this and that for brooke so i know exactly what he means when he says oh. he's sorry because my sister had to pick up you okay. know a lot of things that okay. that he said he was gonna do or he you know whatever but yeah. yeah so he didn't he did let me in he's very he's being very open about all this stuff and i think it's really good and i i think with all of this that you know, I, I hope she feels or sees him in a little bit of different light because I know right now she kind of, it's almost like she would take pity on him in a way. And I want her to 
see him as the strong individual that she met instead of this smaller broken guy that ended because to me he feels very grand and macho and like that's what he wants to be almost like i go to the gym every day and i'm kind of a badass like that type of thing yeah. but i'm really cool and i can take your wife if i want to like that's kind of what <laughs> that's kind of how it, but very 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 nice so hang on very sweet very kind-hearted he is he's a good guy hang on let me get uh he said he said you know what i mean i said what he said it's so messed up when you don't get your your priorities straight and it hurts other people in the process hang on he said i was so selfish at that point in my life i didn't know what to do hang on he said something oh man he would go on benders he's talking about waking up with like pants on but no underwear on and he's talking about not being able to remember like what happened the night before and <laughs> knew it was fun but like yes he's talking about partying with people that are a lot younger than him too would he do that um probably you know it's okay he's like just taking me through these are images that he's just showing me back and back and back hang on Hang on. Wait, would he be the person that bought drinks for everybody but wouldn't have anything behind it? Yes. <laughs> he says, he's showing me, he's like, I'd be the one that's like, yeah, 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 yeah. Yes. Like, but I would go home and it'd be like negative 400. Yes. 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 Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Do you see how many pages? I filled out four pages so far for you. Let's oh. get this. No, this is good. This is the intensity. So this is him. BTW, he's yeah. got that buying, and then we'll get. Hold on, we're gonna move into dad too, but I won't. Hold on, and and every ah, so many. Hang on, uh, it was like my expectation versus theirs versus you know. Hang on, hold on. Oh wow, so they actually did get a divorce fully, because he says, um, "This is my last thing for him for right now, and then we can go on more, and then if." sister let me know on that it's a totally different thing he's talking about wait okay so they got married while he was actively in the military because mm -hmm. okay, he's because he shows me like when i got married to a military guy oh and then got a divorce but he's showing me like that with them and he's saying like i'm sorry i couldn't um keep my end of the bargain up i'm sorry i couldn't do that so just let her know that Okay. Oh, well, thank you. <laughs> yeah, not a problem. Wait, do you have any questions for him right now or any questions about anything for him before we? <sighs> I just miss him and I just wonder if he sends me signs that I'm missing. Now, this is a whole thing with him. I feel like he's, I don't know if it's a whole sign thing for him. I think with him, it's going to be a lot of songs. That's a whole thing, like radio <laughs> type of thing. <laughs> Okay, but like funny. It's gonna be funny. It's not gonna be emotional. It's not gonna be like, I miss you. It's gonna be <laughs> like I slapped the cat on the ass and ran out the door. Just something <laughs> fun that makes you laugh because he's very joking and jovial with you. He shows a very different mm -hmm. side of his sister. And so, but the other thing I want you to feel is again, like if you kind of feel like a weird presence, not a bad way, but you're just kind of like that, you know, mm -hmm. that's what it is. The feeling he's never gonna show up and be like, boo but he's just <laughs> going to be this um, happier, jovial feeling. He just sent me another symbol and I don't know because I can't attach it to anybody. Was there, I don't know the date of this. When is his daughter's birthday? Um, October 4th. Okay, because he's showing me balloon, which means like anniversary or birthday. And so I'm like, where are you going with that? But like, I don't feel anything this month or last month. Or next month. And so I'm like, I think he just, his birthday, I think it was in the end of March, like it, like the 30th or 31st or okay. I think. Okay, confirm with me on that or not, because he literally just shows me white balloon and he ties it to himself, or it's like he only has two people that he cares about, is him or her. So I'm like, it's either an anniversary. Yeah, it's birthday. probably his birthday. Okay, okay, okay. Hold on. Did 
Did Deborah talk a lot? <gasps> Did Deborah talk a whole lot? Okay, because he makes a comment about Deborah. I don't know why, because I'm asking about a mom. Like, I'm like, what about, I'm like, do you have anything to say to your mom? So I'm talking to him about it. And he said, oh, no, not really. He's like, but she has a lot to talk about. And like, shows her like, kaka, 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 kaka. and so I'm like, okay, who's that? And he makes me look here. I'm like, fine. So that's, they're, they segue. I, it's like a big grid in here, okay? Hold on. Let me go to um, dad first. I'm going to have to tune down for, for dad. So hang on, hang on. Tell thank you after all this, by the way. Okay. Oh my. Let me get into that. Give me about 30 seconds to transition. And we'll go from here. Hang on. Was dad, he said he stepped out of your life a lot. Hang on. He says very hard to transition. He's also talking about, hang on. He's talking about he, he's talking about how his actions were so quick and he didn't have a lot of thought behind it all the time. And like, that's kind of what, hang on. Was he really big into drugs? I do not know. He might have been. And okay. I was a kid and didn't know. Gotcha. Okay. Because he's talking about like he's comparing it over here, but it's it's a different type. It's not cocaine. It's different. Hang on. Hang on. Oh, fell to my knees at the bottom. Hold on. Hold on. Let me tune down more. Obviously, he feels a lot of guilt compared or going to you because he's talking about making it up to you. And he, like, shows me these little, like, fatty hands, but they're strong. And he, like, shows them like this. And he was like, if I could make it up to her, I could. But that's what he shows me. It's like opening himself up. And I'm like, okay, hang on. Talking about we always trend it long. He's very down on himself. He said nobody was ever proud of him. I don't know why, though. Hang on. Did he have a lot of anger issues, too? I'm not sure. You're not sure? It's okay. It's okay. But he's talking about let my anger get the best of me. I'm like, okay, what else happened? Hang on. Why is he saying they didn't want to see me? Did they? Did nobody go see him? Really? Um, my sister never went to visit him in prison. I was always the only one to go visit him. Oh no! Yeah, he's like he's like they didn't. It, it's not nobody came to see me. Hang on. He's saying I would do better. I would do better. He's like talking to you about I do better. Hang on. Hang on. Wasn't my fault. Hmm. Hmm. He's taking his life into his own hands in my head. That's where he's attesting himself to right now. Hang on. Stupid and then let it go. Hold on. He's talking about being like worn and tattered down. He just feels like, did he have, did he walk with kind of a limp a little bit or something like that? Do you know about that? He um, lost his foot. He's a diabetic. And so when he was in prison, he got an infection in his toe and then they, they cut, cut, cut. And then, so we ended up having to be in a wheelchair. Oh my God. Um, so okay. A little bit up of his leg, one of his legs. 
oh my god okay because when he's showing me he's showing me up and walking but this is how he's showing me watch which i know it means something to do with the leg or the foot so i'm gonna stand up for you when he's walking he's walking like this <laughs> yes like that at me and that's why i'm like okay so does that mean you're showing me, like that you're having an issue okay okay yeah they amputated his foot and a little bit of his leg shin Oh my God, my poor baby. Well, no wonder he had it worse than my other guy. Hang on, hang on. What is he talking about? It went straight to my heart. What happened with him? Um, I'm not exactly sure. Um, I know he had kidney failure, re re renal failure is what the certificate says. Mm -hmm. um, and that was, I think due to the diabetes yeah so and i don't really have any um answers as far as his passing um okay. i i have questions for him though <laughs> yeah yeah let's do it well he's talking about i said so how did you die what happened and he's talking about not taking care of himself and like that's kind of what goes downhill from that and i said okay on that and he's talking about just letting it go which he's in a very like sad somber state where he's at so it's it just means like I kind of missed out on life a whole lot and I fuck things up a little bit and like, you know, I'm trying to get better, but yet he's still such a sweet man internally as well. So this is the whole thing. Like he's not a bad person. His little heart's in the right place. And then he's talking about like how it just hit his, not saying he has a heart attack, but saying like it just went to his heart and like that's what ended it all. And I'm like, okay, hang on, hang on. He said the swelling was impeccable, Amy. So I guess he had a lot of swelling going on. I said, okay, hang on, hang on. Wait, did he have, had he only, when he passed, had he had only been like out of prison for like maybe a month when he died? He was out five days. Okay, because he shows me, he goes, this is the exact phrase. He says, I went out of one prison and into another. And he was in a halfway house. Oh, my he God. He was in a halfway house because he was locked up for, like, 16 years. Wow. No wonder he's so hard. That makes sense. That makes no wonder. He never got to, that's why he's vibing at a lower rate. That makes sense. Okay. Okay, hang on. Hold on. Why is he saying I didn't want them to bother with it? He's almost talking like, hold on. Wait. He's blaming what happened to him on his diet. And I'm like, I know. And I'm like, but you weren't helping it at all. And he's like, I like snacks. I'm like, I know. And he's talking about they don't give you the best food. I'm like, I know. Um, and he's talking about like hoarding things. And I'm like, okay, that's a whole other thing. Hang on. He said he was on for good behavior. So he did a good thing. I'm asked, trying to figure out what he did that made him go in there for 16 years. Hang on. It doesn't bother me. It's just interesting. Hang on. I don't really exactly know why either. Really? <laughs> I mean, I have, my family's told me stories, but I don't, I don't know if I believe it or not. I know. Hang on. Now, he did say, he just said, I wasn't exactly the best guy back then. And I'm like, oh, okay. Okay. He said, but that's water under the bridge. I said, fine. Yeah. What questions do you have for him? He's, he's definitely a phrase person. Well, I really want to know why he didn't contact me or anybody when he was released. I got no letters nothing i didn't even know he was out until he was dead and somebody called oh my god hang on he's not even that far away he's still in texas when he's released correct yes he was in uh, navasota yeah yeah okay because yeah. i asked him Okay, perfect. Because I asked him, I said, why didn't you contact? I said, somebody could have come. Go. I was like, how far away are you in a different state? And he's like, well, no, I'm just around, like, right here. I was yeah, like, I'm okay. right. In the he, was, he was in a halfway house in Rosenberg or Richmond. Right here. Literally right here. Mm -hmm. Oh, my God. Hang on. Hang on.
he takes really big pity on himself. He's like, what do you think they would do? He's like, they'd pick up an old man that has nothing to work. Where, where would I go? What would I do? It's honestly kind of in a way like saving face and like keeping his pride in a way. Hang on. Hold on. Wow, so he passed actually in the halfway house. Mm -hmm. That's why I asked him. I said, so how did they rush you to the hospital? And he's talking about like laying there and that's. I don't the, even know what happened, yeah. Yeah, that's what he's talking about, finding him dead there. I'm like, oh my God, hang on. Hold on. Is his mom died? Is his mom passed? Yes. Cool, okay, because I. He just says, he says, don't worry, I'm with my mama. I said, okay. He's a good guy, baby. He's he okay. is. He's getting there. He's getting there. Hang on. Kids. Does he have two kids? Okay, cool. Because he said, he says, I want, I want to let my kids know that I love them and that I'm proud of them. Like, and he's just, he has this, like, has this, like, just, I'm going to cry right now because that's just how it feels. <laughs> oh, man. Oh. Uh. Now, I do feel like he feels a little bit stuck. This is some stuff that I'm stuck there. I'll find my way out. So, it's almost like he's just very, 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 um, confused and and right now so in this moment with him and and after when we're done if you can just pray to him and call on him and tell him to come see you and come be with you and that you love him like we need to shower him with love that's what we need to do okay yes. it's a big thing because that's going to allow him to move on and 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 find more peace than where he's at right now hang on hang on <sighs> Hold on. I asked him now, I said, why didn't, why didn't you write anybody? What is that? And he said, you know, Amy, at some point you just don't want to be a bother. Oh. I know that I figured he, he was probably feeling like that, but I was ready to like take care of him and be there for him. I know. I know. I think I think pride for him couldn't do it either. I think he's just trying to do it. Do it on his own. Hang on. Okay. Put a big man in a tiny. Oh, was he cremated too? Yes. Cool. Okay, because he said, was he really big when he passed? <laughs> yes, he's a okay. big guy. Okay, because this is what he specifically said. He said, Amy, he said it was hell to put a big man in a tiny box. <laughs> <laughs> we actually have these ashes right here. Oh, my God. You Okay, there you go. There He's, he's great. He's keep him. Keep him. He's a wonderful person right now. Hold on. Hold on. Better than I, he's talking about watching out over y'all better than he did in life. Hang on. <laughs> wait, wait. Wait, do you have a daughter? Uh, no, I have a son. Okay, hang on. Because he's talking about watching out after the granddaughter. Is that the older one? Is the granddaughter the older one? Hang on. Um, that would be my niece, which is Brian's daughter. Oh. Um, so her. So this is mine and my sister's father, biological. Mm -hmm. Um, and our kids are like six weeks apart. Really. Oh, yeah. Okay. Okay. Hang on. Hold on. He's making, he's making fun of pregnancy together. Oh, of us being pregnant together? Yeah. Yeah. He's like, oh, that was a bottle of laughs. He was like, cry together, complain together, all these things together all the time. Hang on. Cravings together. He's like going through the whole thing. Hang on. Wait, were y'all cra were your cravings opposites from each other? Well, so I'm not sure. Was it really? My sister lived in California when we were pregnant at the same oh, time. Okay, okay, okay. 
Hold on. He's just talking about like the energies all together. Hang on. Oh man. Wait, are you? Do you want to have a second kid? No. <laughs> no. Because he's saying do for another one. Oh no. Maybe my sister. I don't. She just ha she has a little. Um, I think she's like four, so she's got another little girl. But okay. Okay, wait, there's something he's talking about do for another one. So just, I'm just going to leave that there. We're not going to look more into that. But um, yeah. <clears throat> for some reason, you email me in a year and you say, holy shit. I'll say, okay, this is remember what we talked about, okay? That's, that's where that comes from, okay? Hang on. Hang on. So one of the questions you have for dad, I want to touch on Deb before I have my next. I love your family, by the way. Tell them thank you so much. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. Um, I just really wanted to know why he didn't contact me when he was released and he confirmed my thoughts on why. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. So very, um, hold on. He's taking me back memory lane. He's taking me all the way back. Like he's talking about like meeting your mom, getting like together, like how all this happened and went down. Was he military for a second or did he want to? Okay, cool. Cause he's showing me shaved head with him, like all the night guards. And then he's talking about, hold on. There's a dog involved here somewhere too. And we'll get, that's another one. Cause they said dog bark. And I'm like, okay, so that means we're bringing that to, uh, hang on, got the little bastard. That's a whole nother thing. Hang on, hold on. That's the words. I haven't channeled dog yet. They're talking about dog. Okay, hold on. Hold on, let me get into, let me go to Deborah real quick. Dad is okay, pray for dad. He's in yes. very different. Brian, sister needs to talk to Brian. You can too, but yeah. sister needs to hear this too. Um, and if sister needs me, just let me know. Let me get into that. Let's see if we can bring Deborah forward. Hang on. Oh, man. She calls you her best girl. Who is this person? It's almost like an aunt or a, or a friend. Like, that's what it is. Like, that vibe. My best friend's mom. Oh, so there you go. Okay. I'm like, I'm like, I'm like, like, I'm like, be a mom, but it's there you go. Hang on. Hold on. Oh, tell my wait, best friend's mom. So your best friend is a female, correct? Mm -hmm. Okay. She's talking about tell my daughter I said I love her. So that's a whole nother thing. So it's like you, her. Hang on. It was always the life of the party. She has this really big, toothy, like, smile when she's talking to me. All talking. Hang on. Did she get cancer? Not that I know of. He's talking about feeling sick and going downhill. Hang on. Hang on. Hang on. Hold on. Hold on. I don't know why she's grabbing this area. What are you talking about with that? Hang on. Let me get into her. <gasps> what? I, I might have, I might know why she's doing that. Why? Tell me. Um, her husband died of a heart attack um, <gasps> when my friend, when we were like 13. Really? Maybe. Wait, had they already, okay, they had already been married for like 16 years at that point or something, correct? We were together for a really long time, yeah. Very, yeah, 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 because she's talking, I'm, now she brings that up, she's I'm like, what does this mean? And she's like, oh, we're together, like, Forever. Hold on. With him? Yeah, there. Well, she talks. I haven't brought him through for it, but when they talk about other people, they always segue. That's what they do. Hold on. Hold on. Oh. Oh my time to go, but it was had, She said it wasn't my time to go. It wasn't my time to go, but alas, it had to happen. I'm like, oh, okay. Hang on. She said, I wish it would have gone a little bit smoother. Don't know what that means. Hang on. Hang on. Daughter was there to say goodbye to her. Wait, was her daughter there when she passed? Mm -mm. 
saying daughter was there say goodbye to her daughter was there say goodbye to her hang on hang on hold on she's very lively in my head and i think she's hiding or like not showing me what happened all the way because she's very happy very talkative very like talking around the subject and we're not getting to it and so i'm like what are we not wanting to tell me yet because that's it's just like talking to a normal person they don't always you know pop it off hang on did she take a lot of medications um not that i'm aware of that i know of <clears throat> she's talking about popping something in her mouth and taking a drink. And I'm like, I don't know what that means either. Hang on. That could also have like four or five different symbols and meanings in my head too. So that's why I'm like, where does this fit with this? Hang on. Hold on. Why is she saying her passing was her fault? God. Why? Um, I don't really know exactly what happened, mm -hmm. but I think she was drinking and she was driving. Okay. Okay. And she was pulling out of a, um, yeah. a house and she got hit. Mm -hmm. Yeah. She's, it's almost so it's embarrassing. So that's like life of the party, that whole thing, blah, 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 blah. Gotcha. Cause whenever people die this day, when it's a stupid thing, I know it's not a suicide because it's not, they, she's in a very happy, nice, good place. Um, but she's like, Oh, it, it was, it was my fault. Not exactly how I'd want, but you know, just, just like that. Hang on. Hang on. Oh, wow. Wait, so they tried to save her? Um, I'm, I'm, not, I'm not sure. I don't really have a lot of details on the incident that happened. Oh, okay. It's okay. So he says, she said, they tried to save me. There was nothing they could do. I was like, oh, okay, fine. Hang on. She said, I'm such a good creative person. She's like, I just wanted to have fun. Hang on. <laughs> yes. Yeah. Creative person. I just wanted to have fun. I'm like, okay, hang on. Was she really into wine? Yes. Oh okay. my gosh. Okay. Yes. Cause she's like, she's like, who knew a couple bottles of wine would cause you to die? And I'm like, oh, okay. That's a random new phrase. I'm like, cool. Hang on. Hold on. Yes. She's talking about if she needs me, I'm here. So she's, she's around. She's good. She loves you. She loves you too. She's very, she's very fast. So I want to take your family that's like more slow, methodical, nice, confident, calm. She's like all over the place, which is good. That means they're happy. They're up here. Hang on. my Wait, is her mother passed as well? No. She's talking about she's with an older female. That's why I'm like, who is this? Who is this? She's with an older female. Because she brings her forward, like just shows an older female with her. Hang on. Keep that there. Hold on. That's all she shows me is like an image. And I'm like, okay, cool. You're with this person. That's the person that brings you through. Hang on. She have more than one daughter? Um, no, just a daughter. Okay. And she has a son. Okay. Because you keep saying kids, kids, kids. I'm like, okay, there are two of them. Hold on. Yeah, she's okay. She's very quick for you. It'd be interesting if I channeled through her because it'd be really, really intense with how fast she is. With how with, intense. With my friend? Mm-hmm. Because the channel goes straight through her. I'm kind of like working mm -hmm. with you through her. And so it's like a double, but through her, it's like, Pah. So what I want you to do right now is <laughs> fabulous session. Um, I told you it'd be good, right? Yes. So, <laughs> it's, really good. It's, not me. it's them. They're good. So what i want you to do right now in closing i didn't realize what time it is um take right now when we get off here get off here and take five minutes for yourself i always say this and have a good cry and have a good breather because you need to let it all out because this is a build up it's a build up of energy and we gotta move it out for a second okay after that 
I want you to take five minutes and I want you to give thanks and I want you to give remembrance and honor to them because that's all part of it, giving thanks, being appreciative. That's what all this means. Um, another thing is over the, like the next two or three nights, you or one of your people may have dreams about them. Okay. Because we've channeled them. So they're like, woo, let's do this. Right. Um, so if you do acknowledge it, enjoy it. I would say if you do win on if and when, if you have a dream about dad, I feel like he is, um, I feel like he may even try to talk, which is, interesting because he's really weak right now because of where he's at he's kind of like lower because he's sad um and so that's why i said we need to pump him up with love and so he may try to talk but most of the time you're probably just going to see him not so much get a conversation out of him so don't think that in those moments that he doesn't want to talk to you just know that he needs more energy okay Got it. So take five minutes have a good breather and if you need me let me know and um, if you have any questions for me after you rewatch and re-listen to it, just email me and ask me, okay? Okay. Okay. So enjoy it. It's a lot of information to take in, but they love you. And just hang out for a minute, revel in it, okay? Okay. Okay. I love you, my dear. Thank you so much. I appreciate it. Anytime. This is what I'm going to do for the rest of my life. If you need me, let me know, okay? Thank you. <laughs> Bye, honey, honey. Bye.